Hello people, I'm the Real Comic Book Gamer, and this is part one of my Xbox Origins Wolverine the game walkthrough. Yes, start a new game. Gold Day Normal. Let's go. This is my second favorite arc uh, I mean superhero game. I mean that behind all the Arkham games. So technically it's like my fourth favorite. But well, yeah, I'd say Origins is better. I mean Batman Arkham Origins is better than this game. Not by a whole lot though. They're both pretty good games. In the not too distant future. The main problem. I'm the best there is at what I do. At least people still living after I'm done being would say that. Here we go. But yeah, that cutscene right there is basically all I want out of a Wolverine movie. Hopefully, maybe after Deadpool, it'll convince Fox that they can make an R-rated Wolverine movie because that would just be so cool. The Wolverine Uncut Edition was really good, though. The normal Wolverine, just the Wolverine movie was alright. But the Wolverine Uncut was pretty good. Mm -hmm. oh. Skydiving. That was land. Good thing there's one guy there to break my fall. Let's break these guys. What's up, buddy? What you got? And there goes your head. Uh, pick you up. Come on, get to oh, there we go. Oh, I, I had it at a bad, bad camera angle. You couldn't see. Oh, I want to do that takedown. Ow! Let's just kill these guys. There we go. This game's so brutal and it's so good. Ugh. Basically what you're saying right now is the whole game. It is pretty repetitive, but so much fun. I don't care <laughs> What 
I haven't unlocked the lunge ability yet. Don't unlock it a bit. Hey, hey. Ha ha. Your health value up. Oh, oh wait, I gotta take care of those guys with guns. I've been too busy trying to go for style points. I just need to kill all these guys. Ugh. There we go. Yeah, lots of limbs come off in this game. This game's popularity was very short-lived because it came out in 2009, which same year Arkham Asylum came out right before Arkham Asylum 2, and everyone's like, best superhero game ever, finally good superhero game, and then Arkham Asylum came out and everyone just forgot about this game. I thought I was supposed to climb something over there, whatever. What do I hit? I, I have a feral sense, and I think I'm supposed to use it here. Oh, oh wait, no. Here we go. Ugh. Bam. But yeah, this game did not get the recognition it deserved. Like, at first, I was like, best superhero game ever. It's up there with Spider-Man 2. Then Arkham Asylum came out, and no one cared. <laughs> oh, this is where I get to take down the chopper. It's so cool. Oh, wait, no, it's not that bad. I wish they would add stealth like they sort of did, but it's very badly done. Ow. Ugh. No guns. I'm like Batman now. No guns. Ugh. Ugh. Just claw your face down a little bit. Come on. Ugh. Ugh. Hey, get back here. Yeah, you don't need your throat. There we go. Ugh. Oh, just cut him in half. That's so cool. Feral senses. This is one of the best movie tie-in games. Like, ever. Ugh. Ugh. I remember I played the demo of this game when uh, when it originally came out at a friend's house. I was like, that's so cool. I didn't get to actually play the full game till years later. Uh, there we go. Go up. Go up. Uh, there we go. Yeah, Wolverine is my favorite Marvel character and one of my favorite superheroes. Because, like, him... Cause it was X Men and Superman were the two characters that I really grew up on. Ugh. Ugh. Of course, Superman is my favorite, but I read a lot of X Men, and then that's what got me into Wolverine. Helicopter, come here! Come on, helicopter! I can't jump at you yet. There we go. Ugh. Ah! Oh. The heck? You don't shoot Wolverine off a helicopter. And there goes your head. Just imagine a Wolverine game uh, movie like this. It'd be so good. Lava man, die. Ugh. I know you can throw these guys into the spikes. It's just not the easiest. Ugh. Uh. Oh, let's go. Okay, I got him. Now you're going to die. Pound your lava face in. There we go. Ah, I'm trying to- Okay, I landed him on that spike, yeah! Just went straight through that dude. Yeah, level two. There are also costumes you can unlock in the game that are really cool as well. Like, you got the classic Wolverine costume, the X-Force costume. Ugh. Ugh. Come on. What up? Ow. Come on, what you got? Ugh. 
Bam. I would not want to get in Wolverine's way. Wait, come here. Oh, come on. Yeah, there we go. Oh, well, you lost your arm. Let's go. Yeah, I got I to admit something. X-Men Origins Wolverine, the movie, is kind of my guilty pleasure superhero movie. I mean, Deadpool was done horribly, but besides that, it wasn't too terrible. Like, Leaf Stryber was great as Sabretooth. He, he added more than just the, the beast Sabretooth. And I really like that. I know there were some terrible CGI claw scenes, but there are actually some cool fight scenes. Like the whole going on a helicopter, chasing the, uh, I mean, going on a motorcycle chasing the helicopter, which is just a completely ridiculous, stupid scene. But it was, I thought it was pretty cool. I haven't seen the movie in a while, though. But it was like my guilty pleasure superhero movie. I knew it was bad, but I still had fun watching it. That's how it was for me. I should probably watch it again. I just hate how Deadpool was done. That was my only problem. Well, like, the 12 seconds Leaf Str I'm not Leaf Wade Wilson was in it. It was pretty cool. Like, Ryan Reynolds was great as Wade Wilson for the two seconds he's in it. Monkey! Ah, oh, Monkey ran away. Let's run this way. Zip line. Let's go on the zip line. Wee. Wolverine looks so determined on the zip line. Well, there you go. To be fair though, I'd rather face this Wolverine than the Arkham Batman, because at least he ends you. Batman leaves you crippled in the sh in like the snowy streets of Gotham, so you're gonna die, and a lot of time like your face is bleeding. So, you're crippled and bleeding in cold streets of Gotham versus actually dying quick from Wolverine. So, yeah, because, I mean, he, like, chops your head off and stuff, but Batman just leaves you there to die. He technically doesn't kill you. The, the uh, you know, the internal bleeding and the cold from Gotham kills you, which he started, but, you know, he doesn't kill you. Ugh. Let's go. Those guys aren't gonna know it hit him. Oh man, the dart landed on that guy. Aw oh, yeah. Level up. Oh wait, no, I didn't. Rage orbs. Come here. Jump from different guy to different guy. <laughs> New ability, claw spin. What? What you gonna do? <laughs> Just tearing these guys up. That's so cool. There you are. Sorry, buddy. Oh, there's someone. There's more people. Oh, I can. Let's try. No. Aha! What you got? Oh, that. Oh man, that was brutal. Oh. <laughs> this guy doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> oh well, that guy. Well, I thought he was pretty cool at first with lava and his machetes, but not so cool anymore. Level up. I love how these guys are polite and won't shoot me while I'm leveling up. Hey, buddy. What's up? Oh. Oh. Okay, that's pretty brutal. Oh, it just throws him away like he's a piece of trash. <laughs> that was so cool. Hey. Oh, you see that counter? Uh. Okay. I'm supposed to aha uh -huh. climb this. Huh. Huh. I don't know how blown claws are going into stone, but okay. 
it works. All right, what are you doing there with your gun? I told you it was repetitive, but I'm just having so much fun. I really don't care about how repetitive it is. 